Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome back to the Arabic Fluency channel. Today we have video number two of our series on essential and frequent Quranic vocabulary. And as we said, by covering this entire series of 100 words, you can inshallah understand about 55% of Quranic vocabulary. With that, let's get started. So today we are going to go through the next 10 words. And the first word is Rabb. And it means Lord. For example, I can say Allahu Rabbi wal Islamu Dini. Allah is my Lord and Islam is my religion. And there are many examples for the word Rabb in the Quran. For example, the ayah Rabbish Rahli Sodri. My Lord uplift my heart for me. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. All praise is due to Allah, the Lord of the worlds. وَإِذْ قَالَ إِبْرَاهِيمُ رَبِّ جَعَلْ هَذَا بَلَدًا آمِنًا And remember when Abraham said, My Lord, make the city of Mecca secure. Word number 12 is the preposition إِلَى And it means to. يَذْهَبُ الْوَلَدُ إِلَى الْمَدْرَسَةِ كُلَّ يَوْمٍ The boy goes to school every day. سَأَدْرُسُ إِلَى الْخَامِسَةِ I will study until five. يَنْظُرُ الطِّفْلُ إِلَى أُمِّهِ The child is looking at his mother. In the Quran we have وَأَنْزَلْنَا إِلَيْكَ الْكِتَابَ بِالْحَقِّ We have revealed to you, O Prophet, this book with the truth. Word number 13 is مَا and we have already covered Ma, which is a relative pronoun, this is the ma, which is a negative particle used for negation. Ma ja al muallimu al yawm. The teacher did not come today. Ma huwa bi sadiqi. He is not my friend. In the Quran, we have the ayah, wa ma Muhammadun illa rasul. Muhammad is no more than a messenger. And we have the ayah. ما هذا بشرا This cannot be human. Word number 14 is a relative pronoun من and it means who. لا أعرف من هذه المرأة I do not know who this woman is. حضر من سيشتري البيت The one who will buy the house has come. المعلم لا يسمع من يتكلم The teacher can't hear who is speaking. And in the Quran, we have the ayah وَمَنْ يُؤْمِنْ بِاللَّهِ يَهْدِي قَلْبَهُ And whoever has faith in Allah, he will rightly guide his heart. Word number 15 is another particle in and it means if. إِن تَدْرُسْ جَيِّدًا تَنْجَحْ If you study well, you will succeed. إن تنجح في الاختبار تنل مكافاة. If you pass the test, you will be rewarded. In the Quran, we have the ayah وإن كنتم في ريب مما نزلنا على عبدنا فأتوا بسورة من مثله. And if you are in doubt about what we have revealed to our servant, then produce a surah like it. And we have another ayah. وَإِنْ يَأْتُوكُمْ أُسَارَ تُفَادُوهُ And when those expelled come to you as captives, you still ransom them. Word number 16 is another particle, أَن هَلْ تُرِيدُ أَن تَأْكُلَ Do you want to eat? أَيْنَ تَرْغَبُ أَن تَذْهَبَ الْيَوْمِ Where do you want to go today? أُحِبُّ أَنْ أَقْرَأَ الْعَرَبِيَّةِ I like to read Arabic. And in the Quran, we have the ayah, وَيَقْطَعُونَ مَا أَمَرَ اللَّهُ بِهِ أَنْ يُوصَلْ And they break whatever ties Allah has ordered to be maintained. We have reached word number 17 and it is إِلَّا And it means except. مَا حَضَرَ الْحَفْلَ إِلَّا طَالِبًا وَاحِدًا Only one student came to the party. مَا أَحْضَرْتُ إِلَّا الشَّرَابِ 
I only brought the drinks. ما درست إلا العربية. I only studied Arabic. Uh, so it can mean only or except. In the Quran, we have the ayah إلا الذين آمنوا وعملوا الصالحات except those who have faith and do good. Word number 18 is the verb آمنا and it means to believe. آمن المسلمون بما قاله الرسول The Muslims believed what the messenger spoke. In the Quran, we have the ayah وَإِذَا قِيلَ لَهُمْ آمِنُوا كَمَا آمَنَ النَّاسِ and when it is said to them, believe as others believe. And we have the ayah, وَإِذَا لَقُوا الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا قَالُوا آمَنَّا When they meet the believers, they say, we believe. We are almost done and we are at word number 19. And it is, ذَلِكَ Which is a pronoun. ذَلِكَ كِتَابٌ جديد. It means that. ذَلِكَ كِتَابٌ جديد. That is a new book. أُرِيدُ ذَلِكَ الدَّفْتَر I want that notebook. ذَلِكَ الْوَلَدُ نَاجِحٌ That boy is successful. In the Quran we have the ayah فَذَلِكَ الَّذِي يَدْعُ الْيَتِيمُ That is the one who repulses the orphan. And we have the ayah هَلْ فِي ذَلِكَ قَسَمٌ لِذِي حِجْر Is all this not a sufficient oath for those who have sense? Finally, we have word number 20, and it is the particle an, which can be roughly translated as about. Madrasati ba'idatun anil bayt. My school is far from the house. Here, an is translated as from. It can have different meanings according to the context. Yibhathu akhi an qamisihi al jadid. My brother is looking for his new shirt. ماذا عن ذلك الكتاب What about that book? In the Quran we have the ayah الذين هم عن صلاتهم ساهون Those who are unmindful of their prayers. And with that we have finished 20 words. That's all for today inshaAllah and I will see you in the next one. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.